Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel and today I have an anti a an app some apps that are that are virus looking apps but are actually not dangerous for your computer. Number one, chromium. Now chromium is a ver is a very protective web browser. The only f there is no downsides. Now it looks now the picture looks blue and the cr the picture looks creepy but as soon as you as soon as you enter into chromium and it says search the web on top is not annoying but the only downside is there's no way to get that off so so it just stays up there just in case you want to search the web yeah here's also some signs that your computer might have been hacked. Number one, your com your printer doesn't work properly and you don't know what it means. If your, if your printer doesn't work properly or if your, com or if you're out of paper, yeah, if, if your, comp if it says out of paper, then you, you might need to get some more paper. Check to see if you have enough paper. If there is paper, but when you print it and it says that again, you have a problem. It's time to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist. Maybe a, spl a specialist can fix the problem. Number two. You receive, so you receive a, you want an iPad on your browser. Now do you know, experience that on your default browser? That is an alarming sign. It's time, it's time to reinstall your a re default browser and re recheck it as your default browser. If it happens again, you have a bigger problem. It's time to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist. Yeah, and you have to do that before any harm gets on your computer. Number three, you experience fake antivirus warnings. Now, if you see some antivirus warnings that look suspicious, a hacker might have gotten to your computer. It's time. Maybe, maybe your, oh, maybe your antivirus has been upgraded. Another bad sign is that you have a new antivirus you didn't install. If you didn't, if you notice that the, if you notice. If you notice that 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 the antivirus program is safe, but you did not install it, and none of your family members installed it, and it, you're sure it's not a hacker, make sure it's one of your maybe it's one of your friends that installed it. If it is not safe, and you did not install it, it must be a hacker. Those hackers are trying to get into your computer to to earn money from you. They're trying to steal money from you. Yeah, this is shocking, you guys. Number three, you have a web a web browser you didn't install. A web browser you didn't install, like that appears on your computer for the first time, me either means that has means if once again check to see if that web browser is safe 
If the web browser is safe, but none of your family members installed it, it must be a friend. It must be, it must be a friend you never met before. If it is not safe, like it's like, oh, I want to steal all your money and data. That must be an alarming sign. It's time to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist. Number six. You, do you have a virus warning? The fake one. Now if you notice that it was real, you have to fix those problems. If it is a fake one and you do that, there's going to be more more harm than good. It's time if you did if you accidentally click fix risk on a fake antivirus warning then restart then starting your computer as new is a good idea. It reinstall all your apps except for the ones you except for the ones you or your best friends did not install. Make sure it is safe first on that older version and then install it on the new version of the screen. If the problem happens again, you have a problem. It's time to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist once again. Number seven, fake ant. <laughs> Number seven, calls. Spam FaceTime calls. Now if you see a fake spam calls on your computer, this must be an alarming sign. You have to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist. Disconnect to the internet until a specialist is done fixing the problem. If one if you have devices connected to your computer, but your computer is hacked, your other devices connected to your computer are hacked as well. Yes, one computer, one device being hacked can affect the other devices you have. So don't get a virus on your computer or else it'll spread to other, one of other computers from your account especially if you are a kid. Make sure the web browser is safe first. Make sure the, your mom agrees with you. If, if you say, if the child says it's not safe, but the mom says it's safe, and the dad agrees with mom, then, you, then your kid has a, then your three-year-old might have a brain disorder it's time to bring them to the doctor or hospital if you, or maybe bring them to the hospital if needed. Number eight. The antivirus is switched off. Yeah, yeah, if the antivirus is switched off, like let's say for example let's say for example a, a web browser that has an antivirus in it if hackers decide to turn it off to to give to steal money from you and you're trying to buy an expensive iPhone and you're at a store make sure make sure you delete the hacker before he steals your money. Number nine. Oops. Sorry, I'll delete that part. But number nine. Oh, yeah, number nine is you won a TV award. I know, I know, that sounds surprising for you, 
for you good people who want a new, a new TV because your t old TV is broken. But a lot of people has got scammed because of that because of that recommendation. Like, come on, Google. Come on, Google. What's going on with you? Like, come on. You know better than to get somebody to scam you if you get a surprise. If it says, woohoo, you got a surprise, like, come on, like, that's something good you should earn, not, not something bad, like, do you remember your goods and bads? Anyways, moving on to number 10. You have an you have an unsafe chromium installed on your computer and it's not your little friend who installed it. If your little friend tried to install a virus on your computer, you might have to ground your kid. But make sure not to scream at them because it's very dangerous for your kid's ears. Remember? Remember when you were a kid and got screamed at school and you said, I don't like that. I know, yeah. Kids don't like that either, so don't scream at your kid. If your kid decides to scream at your mom just because of that one little mistake that your mom made, don't be surprised, but you try not to. If it, if it is not your little child that installed it, make sure you make sure you call the police and tell the police whoever installed the malware. They probably might get arrested. Just like when they steal a car when you are trying to go on a vacation. Make sure you, I'll oh, make sure you dab it on the head of me, or you dab it, me, you dab it, me, you dab it, me, you dab it, me, you dab it, oh, sorry about that, that's just what, sometimes one, this, that's what Logan Paul said, like, Make sure you dab it on the hairs. Yeah. You should go check that out. It's not going to be in this description, but you have to search it up. On any browser you have. On Lits. It's an unsafe browser. That's all the signs that your computer has been hacked. Now, let's see some signs that your phone has been hacked. Number one. Now, some of these are going to be the, as the same as the computer. But number one. You receive fake antivirus warnings on your antivirus software. Now, if you receive fake antivirus warnings, and you check your other antivirus browser, antivirus website, and it says you did not have these viruses, you're in big trouble. It's time to disconnect. It's, it's, it's time to stop those hackers. But if the hackers don't stop, you know what you have to do. Make sure you go to the, their location and slap them in the face. Just 
kidding. And just kidding with you guys. Don't become a bully. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that part I was just kidding with you. Like, come on, don't think I'm a bad kid. Like, come on. Who would do that? Oh, yeah. When I said that, I was just kidding. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm going to delete that part, but... But here is another sign. Here, let's get back to the signs that your phone might have been hacked. Uh... Number eleven. You number number I mean number two. The battery drains faster on your phone. If you notice that the battery is draining super fast and you have to make an important one hour call, but after thirty minutes your phone is dead, pay attention to your antivirus. Check check to see if there's threats on your phone. If not, then there is some suspicious app running in the background of your phone. Number three, you receive, you have new apps you did not install before. If you have a new app that you did not install before, like let's say for example, you did not install Chrome, but you have it on your phone anyways, and it's not your mom either, then you are in big trouble. Have to disconnect from the internet and call a specialist. Number four, the antivirus or or your ad blocker is switched off. You don't want annoying ads, don't you? Don't you? If your if your phone suddenly has ads and you're sure that your antivirus is on, check your check to see if it's off. If it's off and you did not turn it off yourself, that's an alarming sign. Oops. Try to hide that. That tiny butt. But anyway. Yeah. On to number five. You won a prize. If you found this thing on your browser, you probably like were like, woohoo! But once you do the things that it tells you to do, you are going to get a scam instead of your happily prize. Like, come on! Like, you know how to give a prize to people, don't you? Don't you? Pretty simple. Like, like just give them the prize you want them to give them. Unless it's a bad prize. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video, and as always, I'll see you in the very next video, or in a part two video. Bye!